First of all, I'd like to thank Carroll High School for the use of the facilities tonight, as well as all the precinct men and women taking time out of their busy schedules to come here to kick off what looks to be a promising year for more of the media. I'm a lifelong resident of the Fort Wayne area, graduated from Bishop Lewis High School in Indiana University, Purdue University, Old White. My wife, Claire, and I are teachers. So we realize the value and importance of education. I taught many different social studies classes in the last four years at Northside High School until the end of the 2009-10 school year, where I and 310 other teachers, as well as the entire custodial staff at the community schools, were laid off due to cutbacks that were passed down from our government. I'm now running to represent the people of Indiana's 84th district in the State House of Representatives. Two of the major issues that I'll be campaigning on are jobs and education. As someone who's seen my own job eliminated, I know firsthand what so many Hoosiers are experiencing, losing their jobs and the means to take care of their families, even after years of dedicated hard work. As your state representative, I will commit myself to bringing jobs to Northeast Indiana and support legislation that promotes our economic growth and development. I also believe that Indiana should work to attract businesses that need the skills that are taught by our local colleges and universities. This would make it easier for recent college graduates to find jobs and increase their chances that they'll stay in this area for the first uh, the start of their careers. In the classroom at Northside High School, I had the privilege of engaging students in the learning process and sparking their interest in government and the rich heritage of our nation. I understood the crucial role that education plays in building America's future. I also know that I also know that the resources and support the teachers will need to continue their work. As a state representative, I will work to ensure that teachers reach this support so our children receive an education that builds a foundation for future success. <laughs> we need to make sure our schools are properly funded to avoid more cuts in teachers, to avoid larger class sizes, which both adversely affects every student that is put into that situation. These are just two of the many issues I am looking forward to working with. I'm just, uh, working on to create a bright future for the 84th district and all the rest of the media. Thank you and have a good night.